What is up everybody? It's Jay Wilkins 79 here. How you doing? I haven't done a movie review in uh, seems like five years. Uh, that's not true though, but it does seem like a while. At least I'd say two, almost three months. I think the last movie review I did was was it 13 Cameras? No, I, I, I don't know, but it's been a while. I don't even remember. <laughs> you know, um, I'm going to do a review now for People Under the Stairs, directed by Wes Craven. And that battery light, I we need to remember to charge up my iPod before I do a video. Because that comes up a lot. Now, Ving Rhames is actually in this movie. And it's about a young boy. And his name is Fool. Or Fool. I was surprised they would make that as his name. That was kind of weird. Anyway... I think it's his uncle or his mom's boyfriend and his mom is sick and the boyfriend of the mom tries to convince him that they do need money so they he gives them an option to go steal some money at a house and eventually he talks fool into it so they go to this house and what they find out when they break in is there is two very unhinged people that live there. I think they're brother and sister. And anyway, they have children in the house that are hidden behind like this wall. Like, they kind of look like monsters, some of them. Like, I don't know if they turned into monsters or what the reasoning was behind that. So, Ving Rhames, you know, goes in the house with the, with the boy, Fool. And I won't tell you what happened to Ving Rhames because I don't want to give it away. I try not to give spoilers, guys, out there. And I know sometimes I've had problems with that in the past. But, and then Fool, they finally see him and they try to find him and kill him. And then the brother and the sister try to help him out to get away from these evil, this evil family that they're in. Water break, sorry. Now, 91, I think, was was that the same year as Candyman? I think that maybe 92, 93. It kind of has the same feel of that movie, the cinematography, I guess I would say. And I like the feel of it. It came out in 91, so back then, you know, as I grew up in the 90s, there was a lot of great movies to watch. I don't know why I never checked this one out, but it always thought to me, well... It sounds scary. People under the stairs, like when I was coming up the steps in my parents' basement, I'd go up and I would think there was someone under the stairs just going by that movie title. So I thought that was kind of strange. Maybe that's why I never saw it. That could be. So out of five stars, I'll give this one, I'll give it, I want to give it four, but I think I'm going to give it three and a half. It was good, but it wasn't great. I probably... Eh, I'm not saying I'll never see it again, but not for at least a while. So, The People Under the Stairs, three and a half stars. This has been my short movie review show, Jay Wilkins 79. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Dislike. Like Llama Monster says, do what makes you happy. The world will keep on turning. Peace. See you later.